Mishima Drift is a lightweight textile jacket with modern trendy looks with lots of features high protection this is a perfect jacket for short as well as city rides hello friends i am kaustub and today we are going to talk about chima drift textile jacket i am already wearing one color and i have two other colors here let's talk in details so this is a textile jacket so i know a lot of people have apprehensions about textile jacket garam hoga acha nahi hai let's go for mesh but this particular model has got features which ensures high ventilation we going to go into ventilation part later i'm going to start first with the construction the jacket is made up of 600 denier polyester and feels nice when you wear it i'm wearing a size s as usual it's got very good level of protection so it comes with c level 2 shoulder elbow and back armors and these are not your usual type of armors these are very ventilated and lightweight armors i'm going to show you the armors now so as you can see here this is the shima air force c level 2 armor it's got the honeycomb structure it's hollow so as can flow throughout it it's also pretty lightweight this is a c level 2 back armor even the shoulder shoulder and elbow you can see pretty flexible again hollow so air can flow through it hollow and lightweight very important so this is one of the main reasons why the jacket is light we going to check the exact weight of this jacket what is the exact weight and how does it compare with the other jackets so now i'm going to check how light is the jacket i have a scale with me i'm just setting it at 0 so 0 and then we just put it on and then close to the camera and let's see One point seven six zero. So the size small is one point seven six zero. Considering that this is a textile jacket, not a mesh jacket. Considering it has got level two armors, this is a pretty light jacket. To compare it with any other textile jacket with level two armor, then you will find the weight is pretty more. Coming to the next protection feature, this this jacket comes with external shoulder sliders. You can see here, and the shoulder slider placement again is nice. It's also flexible. C level two armors, external shoulder sliders, 600 denier polyester. It's a fantastic combination and provides you decent level of protection for short rides. I think it has got more than enough. Now coming to the ventilation part. A lot of people feel that the mesh jackets are best for Indian kind of weather where most of the cities, most of the places in India are hot unless you are heading to north or northeast in certain uh, seasons. Now this is something uh, debatable. Yes, mesh will always be better than textile, but there are ways how you can build this and get the best possible ventilation. So traditionally, most of the textile jackets will have vents in front and vents in back, so that cold air flows in and hot air flows out. So what happens is when you have the slits on these sides, there's not much. volume for there is not much space for the air to flow in and out and it really doesn't create a great significant effect what shima has done here is a very smart thing they have given an additional vent in the center i'm going to show you now how so the jacket comes with two zippers this is the zipper one main zipper and this is the second zipper when you use the second zipper you have additional 1 inch of ventilated strip so the air goes in from the center balloons out to the back so this creates a pocket of air inside your jacket and it ensures good ventilation additionally of course there are two two vents on the armpits left and right even the zippers 
come with two zippers. The first zipper can be used for adjustment, and then the second zipper, which can be used as additional weight. In the back, Chima has not given zippers, so it's just the belts, which is always open. So you don't have to. Anyways, it's very difficult while riding if you have to open something in back. It's not easy. So I think this is a good feature that you just have the open slits. So this dual center zipper ensures that you have good ventilation. What I like the best part about this jacket is the looks. It looks very modern. It does not look like your normal riding jacket. It has very trendy looks. You have very nice, exciting colors like the high flow here and the high vis red here. And there are a lot of small, small details like the design on the high vis part, the reflectives, front back. So the jacket looks very, very trendy. It's a very different looking jacket. And this is what makes the Shima Drift stand out as compared to the other jackets. Optionally, in terms of protection, you can also add a chest protector. So as usual, the standard one-piece Shima chest protector comes with two Velcro straps. All you have to do is, the jacket also has got Velcro straps. And use it. So as easy as that, so you can additionally add Apart from the C level 2 armor, a chest, chest protector. Optionally, this jacket also comes, can add a hood here. So, what you can see here is a hood. I don't know what's the function of hood, I think it's more for the looks, but it definitely adds a trendy look. You can buy a hood of the matching color, you can also buy a hood of a different color, create your own different look. And the hood is just zip to the jacket here next to the collar. It also has got a button. I think it looks cool, so a good accessory to have. No particular uh, functional advantage, just an aesthetic uh, addition. To the jacket. Overall, the fit of jacket is not very snug. It's a standard, regular fitting jacket. Uh, I wear a size S usually. It's slightly loose for me here, but this is how the jacket is. Uh, you could easily wear it over and above your usual office uh, clothes or for short rides. For the adjustments, you have the adjustment at the cuffs. So Velcro adjustments here and a couple of Velcros at the waist. So this jacket does not come with any liners. Uh, you can buy the liners optionally. There's a thermal liner that comes along. There's a rain liner which you can wear it from the above. Uh, but if you buy the liners with the jackets, optionally it's going to work out expensive. Uh, if your requirement is to buy a jacket with liners, if liners are really your requirement, both the liners or single liners, it would just be wise to choose other models from Shima which comes along with the liners. Because if you want to use liners with this, you are purely defeating the purpose of the jacket. The purpose of the jacket is for short rides, for daily commutes, for city rides. So where you won't require the liners, so which is why you know, liners don't come with this jacket. Uh, this is my complete, uh, you know, view on this. Of course, if you like the design and want the liners, you can always buy a standalone rain liner. You can use even the thermal liner from your old previous jacket. You can buy thermal liners from Shima, which are very expensive, or you could just use, you know any other uh, brand thermal liner, you are spoiled for a lot of choices. Overall, the jacket is nice, comes with a lot of features, good protection, trendy looks, and the jacket comes with a lot of sizes. So I'm wearing a size small, and the highest size you can get is 4XL. So covers a wide variety of sizes, three colors. This is the black, gray, the 
high vis pro and high vis red they all look great you can buy them on ttihub.shop you can buy them with our partner stores across various city i would suggest make sure that you are referring the sizing chart before ordering because the size is slightly different than the other jackets for shima so refer the sizing chart we have given the sizing chart on our website or call us we will guide you on the sizing pick up color size of your choice just go ahead order it's a nice jacket the jacket is priced at 13999 14000 hoodie is optional chest protector is optional level 2 is already included liners are optional so this is all about the shima drift jacket i hope you like the video if you have any particular questions on this particular model do drop in a comment we give up all the details the purchase links below in the description do click do go check it out and finally make sure that you like the video make sure you are sharing with the, with your other fellow riders and if you have not subscribed to our channel please do it now till next video ride safe stay safe bye bye